Well, Fond du Lac police are still investigating the death of a man who police say they found in the middle of the road. NBC 26's Ryan Curry is live in Fond du Lac now with those details. Ryan. Regina, this is the 800 block of Grove Street in the middle of the road. That is where Fond du Lac police say they found a man with a significant head injury. Now, the, now the man police are talking about is 32 year old Joshua Farr and, police, and when police found him, he was unresponsive. He was then taken to a local hospital to receive treatment where eight days later he passed away. Now police say the cause of death was damage to the head. Earlier today, we spoke with Farr's mother. She says her son was a drug addict, and this is the second time her son received damage to the head. The first time, she says someone assaulted Farr and believes the same thing happened again. Now, police will not confirm at this time whether Farr's death is a homicide. At this point, uh, we're trying to determine exactly what happened to Mr. Farr, um, what caused that head injury, and how he ended up uh, in the middle of the road on Grove Street. It's a caring caring person. Everyone's got their own addictions and unfortunately he just couldn't kick his because it was too available to him. Now right now police are ruling Farr's death as suspicious. Farr's mother says when Farr was in the hospital he was on life support for those eight days before passing away. Reporting live in Fond du Lac, I'm Ryan Curry for NBC 26.